Consistency, the buzzword that everyone loves to talk about. How do you get out of plat? Consistency. What does it take to be a grand champ? Consistency. What's the difference between a pro and an SSL? Okay, okay, <laughs> you see where I'm going. The problem is consistency isn't something you could train directly. Well, that is until now. Introducing the Bacchus Mod Checkpoint Plugin, a free play training tool that will completely revolutionize how fast you can get better in Rocket League. Today, I'm gonna walk you through the download, the setup, and how to start using this new tool today to master your car control faster than anyone else. Also, I have been absolutely swamped with DMs about my coaching. So if you want in, last call, send me a DM on Discord with the word mechanics to learn more. Anyways, let's get started. All right, starting with the download, this is the quickest step to get the checkpoint plugin. All we gotta do is navigate over to the Bacchus Mod plugin website. From here, you're gonna wanna search checkpoint plugin and make sure you download the one by Nitro OP. You're gonna get a pop-up that says open plugin installer, approve any permissions that pop up, and there, boom, you have the client installed. Now, all you have to do is open up Bacchus Mod, open up Rocket League, and the plugin should auto load. That's step one. Now for step two inside the setup, this is where things get tricky. So pay attention very closely. Okay, first thing you gotta do is open up the Bacchus Mod interface and you're gonna do that by pressing F2. And once you're in the plugin interface, you wanna click this box here that says apply bindings. After you've applied bindings, go one tab to the left, open up the Xbox D-pad up button and remove the binding that is going to freeze the ball. All this does is it makes it so that we can still use Bacchus Mod. We can still use the up command on the D-pad that is with Bacchus Mod to spawn the ball on our car without using any extra inputs. So for step three, now all we have to do is set up the exact shot that we want. To do so, first thing you need to do is run through the motions of whatever shot you wanna set up. I'm pretty sure the plugin will track 15 or 20 seconds back, so you don't have to worry about timing anything precisely here. Once you go through the motions and you find the freeze frame that you wanna rewind and be able to go back to, you're going to click down on your right stick to freeze the moment. Once the moment is frozen, you can use the left and right steer buttons, whether your KBM, that would be A and D, or controller, your left and right joystick inputs, to rewind forwards and backwards through time. This is gonna allow you to pinpoint the exact moment where you went wrong in your mechanic and train it precisely. Scan back and forth to find the moment that you'd like. Then, once you've found that moment, you're gonna hit the reset shot button. Important, you have to make sure the reset shot button doesn't control any of your actual car movements in Rocket League. I just picked the share button for mine. Finally, once you hit that reset shot button, that new shot that you just freeze framed is going to be saved to a library of your free play shots. Now you can just use the left and right D-pad buttons to scan through your shots and you should see your shot right there. Now that you're at the shot, any movement is gonna kick things off and boom, you are practicing the exact situation you want to practice customized for your needs. This plugin is absolutely nuts. A few extra tips that you can play with yourself is if you scroll down in the plugins tab, you'll have the opportunity to set when the checkpoint resets. So if you're going for an aerial mechanic, for example, and you wanna reset every time the ball hits the ground, you can automate that to get reps in even faster. If you do that, you'll literally be able to construct mechanics that you had no clue how to tackle from the ground up. So whether it's hitting that second reset on the double flip reset, getting the redirect off the backboard on the double tap that you usually mess up, or just getting your car in the right position to make a touch, using this plugin is gonna allow you to pinpoint the exact moment that you usually fail and correct it so that you can learn mechanics faster than anybody else. Let me know what mechanics you start using this for down in the comments below. I'm really excited to see your ideas because I think this is honestly going to be a game changer with how quick you can progress. Trust me, if you could start to use this plugin right, you are going to learn mechanics two times, three times, or even four times as fast as everyone else.
Before the video ends, just wanted to say a huge shout out to Lazard, the owner and founder of the Rocket League free help discord for putting me onto this training tool and helping make this video possible. So if you don't know who he is, now is the time you meet him. He actually doesn't know I'm doing the shout out in the video. If we could do an absolute raid on his discord for putting me onto this plugin after this video, that would be unreal. It would absolutely make my day. I'll put his link down in the comments and in the description below. Other than that, if you want more coaching from me, DM me mechanics as we talked about on Discord. I'll try to get back to you as fast as possible. And for now, that's all I've got. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.